trying to underwrite your loan and you run out and buy a new car. This has happened. No, this has happened. It has happened. When a, when a lender determines your ability or to, to, to be a potential buyer and they're saying that you're a candidate that they would lend to, they're looking at your current financial status. So that's how much you actually have in your bank account at any given time. That is your credit currently at any given time. But if it changes throughout the home buying process, then they're, they can say, well, now we don't approve you because your, your income has changed, your cash reserves have changed. So your realtor, hopefully, if they're worth their weight, they're gonna tell you, do, watch me, watch me, do not breathe. <laughs> do not do anything while you're waiting for your loan to go through. Definitely don't go out and finance a room full of furniture don't go get a car. Don't go lend $15,000 to Aunt Betty. We don't, not while we're waiting to purchase our home, okay? You've closed, you guys. You've closed. You've signed all your documents. Yay! You've signed your documents. You got the keys in your hands, and you can't believe it. I cried when I bought my first property. Anybody else cry? You could believe it. Who did a holy dance? Who did a holy come dance? <laughs> Okay. 